The same thing is over to G right now. We're no under, no longer under weather alert. Think yeah, we, we still have it for a while, uh, probably till about 5:30 or so. But now another alert for heat watch excessive. That's in effect from Wednesday, and that's from Warren down Ocean County for an index up to 105. So we're dealing with the rain that's tapering off, and in comes the heat and humidity for Wednesday, and then scattered showers, thunderstorms, big change end of the week. Let's go day by day. 79, 83, 82 degrees up to the north. That's one. The scattered showers and thunderstorms over the eastern end of Long Island will continue fast moving, speed of the game, and that will be out of here by roughly 6.30 or so, and the thunderstorm watch will end. Now we got a couple of scattered showers down at Breezy Point, and again, we're watching this carefully, uh, and across New Jersey, Little Egg Harbor, Beach View, they're moving at about 15, 20 miles per hour now, and they're weakening, you can see, and then the flow of air becomes northwesterly, we dry it out tonight. So if you're heading out to Flushing Meadows, it's going to be good. Uh, it'll be warm. So drink a lot of water if you're a spectator or just walking around. High pressure will come in for a good day tomorrow. Humidity climbs late. Now, the leading edge of this cold front approaches. There's a surge of southwesterly, and all the models put us right around the lower 90s. Some models a little higher. What the heck's the difference if it's 92 or 93? Spots west of the city could get to 95. Short-lived. The leading edge of that cold front comes on through and snaps the heat and we get back into autumn Thursday Friday and Saturday remarkable switch in pattern and weather change 95 will be your heat index that's the reason why the advisory is going to be in effect I think for the city and again you could see uh, temperatures this is a Wednesday at night right around 87 degrees 75 north and west the scattered showers and thunderstorms will be on Wednesday night now we look forward to the weekend Weekend. There's going to be a dip and a dive in the jet stream. The heat is going to go on Wednesday. The rain will go on Wednesday, and the cool Canadian air will dominate on Wednesday as well. Shout out to my buddy Jim Witt, Hope for Youth Foundation, uh, which I'm part of. They're giving out backpacks uh, for all the kids at Peak Skill High School, so we want to congratulate them. Backpacks loaded with everything these kids need for a successful school year. All right, this is Tuesday. This is Wednesday. Wednesday, all right, that's your day to watch. Next one, Thursday and Friday look great. Could be a stormy period on Saturday. Back half of the weekend looks good, and Labor Day looks very good right now.